6ix9ine has only 25 days left on house arrest until he is supposed to be completely free with zero restrictions. But unfortunately for 6ix9ine, after some of the mistakes he has been making recently, he might be handing himself back to the police for violating many of his release terms, and we will show you why in today's video, so stay tuned. Also, don't forget to leave a like on this video if you are a fan of 6ix9ine, and if you would like to join this month's giveaway of a brand new iPhone 11, then all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and watch this video until the end to find and comment the hidden message. Good luck. Now, 6ix9ine has been free from prison and serving the rest of his sentence at his house for about three months now. And as you all have seen, he is back on social media and he's acting like himself once again. He recently released his third track since being released, Yaya, after Gooba and Trolls already did extremely well. Gooba broke a YouTube record and Trolls even went number one with all three of them already combining for over 1 billion streams. That is insane, especially considering that almost everyone assumed that 6ix9ine would have no career after he snitched in court, and definitely no one expected him to have any cosigns or features, but it looks like we were all wrong because right now, the hype around 6ix9ine is bigger than ever, and he obviously has rappers that are still willing to work with him. So it's safe to say that regardless of what 6ix9ine does, it seems like he will always have hype around his name and his career will never be over due to lack of attention. Now as most of you know, 6ix9ine has been at home and he's been able to use social media and he's been recording music videos in his house, but he has not been completely free of restrictions. He is still serving time just at his house instead of the prison, but he only is supposed to have 25 days left on house arrest before he can be completely free to move around how he wants and do what he wants. But before this is decided, he will have a court hearing and things might not go the way he expects them to. In his mind, he thinks in 25 days he's off the hook, but during 6 ix 9s release, he vowed to only use his social media to promote his music and not to go back to trolling and starting beef with other rappers, but clearly we have all seen that did not stick to his vow at all. During the first month of his release, he was extremely quiet and he didn't break that vow, but after he released Gooba, the trolling began instantly. All of 6 ix social media activity is being watched very, very closely and he has not been being very smart about certain situations at all. He has already gone back and forth with so many rappers and he has constantly been trolling and starting problems and all of this while still being looked at and considered before his house arrest is complete. This is a very bad look for 6ix9ine in the eyes of the judge who released him early because in all honesty, it makes the system look like a joke. It kind of makes it look like 6ix9ine can get away with anything that he wants, which could actually be bad news for 6ix9ine and if things don't go his way, he could be getting back into more trouble for not sticking to his word and only using social media to promote his music. If you saw before the release of his new song Trolls, 6ix9ine went on IG Live. What's up y'all? I'm feeling it right now. And he went full savage mode. He got on Meat Mill, Snoop Dogg, Future, multiple other rappers very, very hard, and he was not letting up at all. He even had Nicki Minaj have to tell him to chill out a little bit. He talked a lot of trash, and he proved that he has no intention of not starting problems while using his social media. With everything that he said, it just shows that he believes he has complete freedom to act like his old self, and with the feds watching his every move, he might have pushed it way too far this time. We will have to wait and see how things unfold, but things will be coming to the light very, very shortly. Considering that he only has 25 days left on his house arrest, we will keep you updated, but right now, 6ix9ine is very confident that he's going to be perfectly fine. Maybe he knows a little more than we know, but it was said that his probation officer has not liked his actions and he will be being watched for the next five years. All of his activity will be, will be like monitored for the next five years, even if he does get off house arrest. That means that they already are not liking some of the things that he's doing. And if he does have his hearing before he's fully released, I think that they're going to take in consideration everything that he's been saying, and I think he may have pushed it a little too far on many, many, many rappers. We don't fully know what this could mean. It could mean that he gets back in trouble. It could have violated some of his terms. He could be extending his house arrest. Who knows? There will be more updates as soon as it comes that time, which is only 25 days away, so we will have to wait for some more updates. With that being said, I am going to end the video here. I do want to know what you think about this situation. Do you think they'll let 6ix9ine just do whatever he wants? Do you think that he's going to have no consequences and in 25 days he's off the hook to do whatever he wants? 
or do you think that the trolling is going to get him back in trouble because he definitely pushed it too far? Let me know where you stand on all of this in the comments. Also, don't forget to leave a like on this video if you are a fan of 6ix9ine, and if you are new to the channel, please subscribe. Mixed Ice Media, see you in the next one.